Arno, a great 100 meter breast show, one, two for the Centurions. Yeah, it was good, uh, happy with the time and the swim. Uh, and you were behind until the last lap, you saved it. Yeah, that's always the same with Nicolo. He has a really good start and a first 50. And I have, uh, I have a great end. Uh, you saw it yesterday on the 200 and now on the 100 as well. I know Aqua are behind and you're playing catch up, but you guys are fighting all the way. Yeah, well, it's fun to race uh, at home for me, uh, back in the Netherlands, so uh, it's fun. So a couple more matches, hopefully the crowd might come back for you. I hope so. Uh, unfortunately, I don't think uh, the lockdown is going to be lifted, but I hope so. Uh, racing in Eindhoven is always fun, but with uh, people on the stands, it's much better. Well, hopefully they're watching the TV and they'll see that Aqua got a one-two. Thank you. Bye. Everybody's looking up to Ilya Shimanovich from Energy Standard in this event. And the only person really that has hope to be able to beat him is an Adam Petey if and when he comes back for London. No Petey here. But there is a Martin Nagy for Aqua and he looks good. Down at the bottom at lane number seven, he will turn first. Three one hundredths of a second in front of Schwingenschlagel. But you've talked about it burning so eloquently before with Martin Nagy. Nobody closes better than him in this field than Martin Nagy. If he has the lead at 75, which he does. Lights out, right? I, I really believe that. Now, McKee's a good closer because he's got a great 200. But here comes Kaminga, his teammate. Aqua's going to go 1 2. Aqua, they love the breaststroke. Kaminga actually gets the win.